all happy this game lets you choose to do things if you don't or let you have a choice to not do th things if you don't want to but it's gonna make me steal this sucks like even if I didn't tip her I still wouldn't have had enough money man uh, now I'm upset say hi to Rose for me stop cheating on her for Christ's sake Gotta tell Gus about this. Can you just sell me something? Shit happen anymore. Just give me something. It's Christmas. Man. Welcome, kid. Hit me up if you want anything. It doesn't let me move on. When I go this way, like I'm pushing forward, all of a sudden it turns me around. Town. Now's my only chance to grab Daniel a present. I don't want to grab him a present. And if I go that way, it does the same thing. It turns me around. This is upsetting. I'd just be like, yo, Daniel. If I have enough cash left, I... I could get a gift for Claire and Steven. I don't have any money. Let me out. God damn it. And this guy's probably going to be staring at me. Because I pissed him off. Well, I'm mad. I... I know it sucks, but... Daniel deserves it, too. No! Right? I didn't want to do that. The game made me do something that I could have had a choice not to do. Care spray. Sorry, man. I prefer my pine trees alive. Dad pushed every year to get a plastic tree, but we never surrendered. Never give up. Never surrender. Well, now I want to leave, leave, because I stole a fucking yo-yo. Yeah. What's with the lag I'm getting? Cool. <laughs> Hop in. Need some crazy Are lag. you having too much fun back there? Yeah. That's what I. Shit. Shit. Where's my mouse? Okay. I have no mouse. That could be why my game's freaking out. Explorer's probably fucking up. Alright. Behave? Fuck. I did not want to steal a thing. <sighs> Looks like Daniel found a new brother. <laughs> no kidding. He dumped me like a rock. I'm <laughs> glad you two came along. It's great that Chris found a new friend out here. It looks like you did too. What's her name? Who? Yeah, does that really count? I met her like for ten, five minutes. Hold on. I'm taking out the thing because my legs are killing me. They're killing me. I don't like using the leg rest. It makes me even gonna fall out of the chair. Who? Who? Come on, don't play me. That cutie you were talking to by the market. Oh, yeah, that girl. She was cool. She was cool. You're too quick. Ah! 
anyway. Got ya! <laughs> it's good for me to get out, too. We've had a rough time over the past couple of years. My wife, Emily, she died two years ago. Oh, we're going to learn their story. Honestly, it was tough on Chris. Shit. Oh. I'm sorry, man. Thanks. It's been a struggle. Especially trying to be a good dad. Having problems? Do you have some kind of problems? I'm just not the man I was. I shouldn't have even brought this up, you know, just forget it. Grandparents worried. Claire and Steven seemed a bit worried about you guys. Well, they stopped by yesterday. They really seemed to care about Chris. But I'm afraid they get the wrong idea sometimes. Claire threatens to call social services. That's true. We are not your usual pretty happy suburban really? family model. But I know... Because when she came over, she didn't threaten that. I guess she could threaten it. Under. To him. My mom left. They are nice. I'm gonna say my mom left because yeah, I don't remember what my, he was saying. My mom left my dad a long time ago. She never came back. She broke all ties with her parents, too. Sorry for bringing that up. It's okay. I hope they don't stress out because we haven't come back. Uh, yeah, we should get you two home. Uh, don't keep them waiting. Yeah. I wanted to talk to him about some other stuff. Dang it. Hey, buddy. Uh, want to set up that Christmas tree? Yeah. Well, I'll get there before you with my dad mobile. <laughs> no way you can be Captain Spirit. <laughs> See you later, Super Wolf. Uh-oh. God, what where you? And Grandpa haven't come back from church yet. Guess not. Okay. Well, at least they won't yell at us for going out. That was so cool to spend time with Chris at the market. So, did you set things straight with him? Told him the truth? Yeah, yeah, I did. He was disappointed. Of course he was. You lied to him. Did you know Chris's mom was an artist? I didn't. You told him the truth, huh? So, she drew comics. You should see her drawings. They're so cool, just like yours. Thanks, dude. Hey. Uh. What? What is it? Sean. I want to go check on the room. Mm -mm. Upstairs. I know it's mom's. Yeah. Please. Nope. Don't freak out. Daniel, you heard Claire. They will freak out if they know we went inside. We won't tell them. We'll be in total stealth mode. Mm -mm. They won't know anything if we make it quick. It's just... I really want to know what's inside. What kind of stuff she had. That Chris sucks, man. Chris has tons of things that belong to his mom. Oh, you can't do it. And I have nothing. Come on, Sean. Mm -mm. You don't even have to come with me. If you don't want to. <sighs> Fuck it. I'll come with you. So you no, make don't make me do... Uh, guys, we had a place to stay. We've been here for two days. And you're already going to get us kicked out. God damn it. No. No, we're not doing it. This is the room you get to observe, buddy. Good. I just... Don't get why they locked the room. They obviously don't want us in it. What's the big deal? Fuck. It's gonna make me do it. Aw, oh, man. Come on, game. Making me do things twice that I didn't want to do. Hey, guess what? I got you a yo-yo. 
Doesn't that sound awesome? Let's not go in the room. We'll find a way to open it. Sean, this is super easy. Fuck. I can just the lock with my power. <laughs> yeah, I could do that with a hammer. But let's try and find the key instead. All right. Yeah, don't break it. Oh, of course. I'm just gonna clean up real quick. <sighs> Mass invasion of privacy. Gonna get us kicked out. Fantastic. Shit. These are Christmas presents? Let's not tell Daniel. Or he'd freak. Yeah, see? No, you tell him and he's like, if we go in that room, we're not gonna get these. Clothes, old stuff. <sighs> Definitely no hidden key. Yes, Daniel. <sighs> okay, Stephen. Where do you hide this key? <sighs> we clearly don't share politics, but at least Stephen doesn't preach. I don't really see Steven listening to old school pop rock music. Yeah, not much to see in here. Really? Man, she has crosses all over the place. Maybe the key to Karen's room is inside. Yeah. No. Yep. <laughs> no way I'm searching Claire's underwear. Sean, I saw Grandma go into the room yesterday. It looked like... You scared me saying I saw Grandma. Left something there, but then she locked the door. Did you see where she put the key? I think uh, she put something in her pocket. <sighs> yeah, of course. <laughs> Love the outfits, guys. Man, they look so different. <sighs> Karen hated collecting trinkets. She used to say they were just useless dust traps. There's a Jada doing a bark. <sighs> Who knew this sweet little muffin would turn into such a brat? <laughs> <laughs> Still super cute, though. Sharp objects. <laughs> Bit like Claire. <sighs> Come on, little key. Don't be shy. Wonder what would have been different if Dad had taken us to church. <laughs> How much more Irish can you be? There's a small key. Didn't know Claire had sleep troubles. I guess definitely not the one. Way too small. But let's see what it opens. Uh, Did I check the clothes here? Okay, Daniel. Uh, think hard. The key may be in one of these pockets. Nope. Whoa. I'm just looking for a key, not the crown jewels. Ew, are these? Her baby teeth. Milk teeth? I'm not sure if it's gross or cute. Milk teeth? Still, Is that what they're called? No key here. Okay, put the key back. Come on, little key. Don't be shy. No, let me put it back. I hate you. Let me put it back. They're gonna know. Nope. Hey, potato. Nothing in here. Come on. Where is this card again? No way she wore it to church. Uh. Maybe. Hey. Hey. If she really didn't want I us going in there. Again Claire was wearing yesterday. You'd think she wouldn't have left the key and something like that. Yes.
Fuck. Get ready to go on the run again. Key, so it better fit. Just try it. Watch mom's living in there. Nope. Wow. There's not that much left. Where do you think they put the rest of her stuff? It's her teenage room. I'm sure she sorted through her things before leaving for Seattle. The rest is probably packed in these boxes. Sean? What do you think happened to all the stuff? They want to forget anything related to Karen. When we left. <laughs> I can relate. I don't know, Anano. I wish I could answer that. Okay. Holy God, there's so much stuff to look at. It's like she almost never used those. I think I remember that one. Karen showed it to me once. You... Ulysses? Ulysses. Hey, Daniel. Check this out. Mama! Hey! His name is Ulysses. Like... The hero? I guess. So cool. They looked happy. How could she send all of this to hell? These pictures are so random. It's the rocks. Yeah. You finally left forever. Green choir. I hear the green choir singing in the forest in the ancient gray, wrapping me in their wood spell, their song, the roots like fuses that explode in reverse. When I hide in my heart, hearing that sound that makes me feel older than the forest, older than you, but younger than the crying river at my feet. If I slid into the soil, would the voices muffle like my face in the pillow so nobody knows I'm there? I could sneak in through the wormholes, but the only would lead down. Step over the treetops, over the river, I feel myself leaving forever. Okay. Hi, Ulysses. Is that an amethyst? <sighs> she was into New Age bullshit. Hey! I like rocks. Oh. Well. Exit the door to somewhere else. Already looking for an exit. Also, there's a letter down here. That light revealed hey. something. That pen pal sure loved listening to her own voice. Here, Karen. Thank you so much for your letter. I thought you might have forgot your pen pal. It's so boring out here and your letters are the best thing ever. You were saying you get very lonely too sometimes up there in Beaver Creek, but I'm glad we found each other. It, it is funny not that I have this big family that I'm so jealous of you for being an only child. You get the whole house yourself like a queen. I told you before how my stupid brother Keaton is such an immature boy even though he's the oldest of all my siblings. He thinks he's so cool now just because he has a driver's license. Whatever. Just wait till we get, can drive, then we can finally visit each other. I hear my dad yelling about something, so I gotta bail before he gets to me. Please write back soon, and I'll write back. I'll write as soon as you do. If I have help, Emma, miss you. So, you were a friend of my mommy's? I hope she took good care. Guess the no phone rule wasn't such a thing back then. Hope you enjoyed your trips. So you didn't bail on us for nothing. Wouldn't this be for before she left? I don't recognize any of these games. Did she take you with her when she went on trips? <sighs> Read a lot of these in the tenth grade. I wonder why mom Yawn. Liked it so much. This playlist is boring as hell. I miss my music. Hmm, not playing anything. Justin Crazy show him his his pants are patched. Can I take this? Karen like to take pictures of strangers when we walk down the streets. <sighs> Never been a big fan of hiking. Been doing plenty Today of that. Walking my way down to Mexico. Huh. 
I think I saw a moon eclipse once, before Daniel was born. <laughs>